This is music, and this is another VCLT unboxing video. Welcome to another VCLT unboxing. In this video, I'm going to unbox. A VCLT that was sent to me by none other than the legend, Mr. Wet Wang himself, Simon from the Pie Face channel. He is one of the most generous members of the VC, and he's got an awesome vinyl community channel where he shows a lot of boy bands, K-pop, and disco music. And by that I mean the nastiest, filthiest, dirtiest extreme metal you can ever think of. Black metal, death metal and the uh, grindcore all that stuff so go and check out his channel now he sent me this package i picked it up today i have no idea what happened to it looks like someone used it as a blunt force melee weapon in some back alley gang fight so this is going to be very interesting so uh let us try to get this open i don't even know if i need yeah need the knife uh uh, 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 I want the knife. I don't know if you know that one. It's from a movie called The Golden Child, starring Eddie Murphy. It's an awesome film. There's even a rat song in it. So, uh, yeah, this one was, was a little bit easier to open because, you know, it was basically on the verge of disintegrating. There you go. Looks like there's a T-shirt or something on top. So let's have a look at that first. So let's see what's on it. Looks, uh, there you go. Mary, kiss my ass. Yeah, that's what Christmas should be called. Kiss my ass. I hate Christmas. Anyways, so uh, looks like this. Looks like there's a good st stack of different things in here. So let's go through them. What do we have here? We got some Emperor. Uh, this is Anthems to the something something at dusk. So uh, yeah, interesting. Emperor, a legendary Norwegian black metal band. I have no idea, you know, where, when uh, this is from or where it is in their discography, but cool. One of my friends back in high school, who was a drummer in a black metal band, uh, he was a big fan of Emperor, so that's cool. Here we got this one here, which I have no idea what that is. Uh, it's, uh, let's see, it says here, it says Shedog, uh, Ode to Something. The title will pop up below. Interesting. So I don't know. Let's let's see if we can. Shapak maybe. I don't know. I assume it's some kind of of uh, black metal too. Here we got uh, this one here. Moon spell wolf heart. I know moon spell, but Portuguese gothic metal band. Uh, oh, yeah. Uh, you can't see it, but it has the classic Wombiria on it. Excellent. Uh, we made a lot of fun of that song back in the day, but we also kind of liked it. Uh, got this one here. Looks like some occult stuff, too. Um, let's see. Uh, maybe er Eritrom Vitriol or something like that. Oops, the CD almost fell out. Looks pretty cool. Looks like it's some kind of kind of black metal too. So uh, what else do we have here? We have uh, oh, this is cool. This is actually really good. This is Ryujin. Uh This is Japanese uh, melodic death metal with you know elements from different. Uh, Different genres of extreme metal. So that's actually really cool. Nice. 
as far as I remember. Uh, I have heard I've heard a couple of their songs before, and I know I like them. Uh, Japanese original rock style, cool. So I wonder what that is. If it's uh, oh, the Hundred Devils, Japanese original rock style, cool. Nice. Thanks. I mean, I don't know what it is, but but uh, I think it's cool. So Thor, Christmas in Valhalla, Thor. That's gonna be fun. Yeah. Nice. Um, I'm just pulling out random stuff here. Uh, what does it say? It says No Man's Land, Last Crusade. Cool. Don't know what this is. Uh, it's a Viking metal. Interesting. Okay. <laughs> some Christmas skulls. Nice. Oh, some skulls. It was one Christmas skull. I don't know that you got more. Uh, what is this here? K-pop, I told you, I told you, moon, be lazy, moon rise, okay, okay, actually full of stuff, that, that's going to be interesting, I do have some of, uh, some of our students are K-pop fans, I assume this is K-pop, um, okay, this is actually, this is actually kind of cool, it seems. So you've got these. I don't know what these are, but there you go. And then you can get rid of the uh, members that you don't like. You know. Yeah, okay, cool. And, and what else do we have here? Kind of a booklet. Okay. There you go. Uh, this is the first K-pop ever in my, I don't even know if it is K-pop, but I assume it is. So it's the first K-pop ever in my collection. I do have some K-rock. Uh, and now some K-pop. I assume. Okay, uh, what else do we have? Here. An envelope with my name on it. Have a look at that. Last. Uh, symptoms of lunacy. I think we've seen a couple of symptoms of lunacy in this VCLT. If you know what I mean. Just kidding. Uh, Rest the elephant. I don't know what that is. Okay. So here we got some uh, blood work. World without end. And this is... Uh, I can't read this. Graveland? Yeah, maybe it's Graveland. Yeah. There you go. Interesting. What else do we have? Reaper. An atheist monument. German metal institution Reaper celebrating the band's 30th stage anniversary with a new album. Cool. Nice. And what do we have here? Uh, it looks, I mean, like a Japanese release because you got an OB on here. So, uh, Nightmare Anima beats me, but I'm certainly intrigued. Okay. Uh, yeah. Nickelback. Uh, all the right reasons. This is the first Nickelback ever in my collection. Are, are there any songs I know on here? Follow You Home, Fight For All, The Wrong Reasons, Photograph, Animals, Saving Me, Far Away. Next contestant, Side of a Bullet, If Everyone Cares, Someone That You're With, Ruxed. I don't know any of these songs, but hey, Nickelback. That's going to be fun. I already have a stack of uh, CDs that he sent me. Um, so now definitely there is going to be 
a summer of Simon this year as well. I'm just uh, just checking. I've got like these two envelopes full of stuff, but I'm just checking to see if I missed something. Doesn't seem like it. Cool. So uh, yeah, let's have a look at uh, at what's in here. So uh, yeah, let's uh, stack of stuff here. Nice. So up first we have um, Karma to Burn. I'll show you this in a minute. Karma to Burn, almost heathen. Hmm? I've heard about karma to burn but i haven't heard them here we have uh wang roach cockroach uh and this is uh the observer yeah we've got the eye there cool uh andrew lloyd weber starlight express so that is uh a musical i have never heard of this musical i actually quite like the andrew lloyd weber uh, production of uh, phantom of the opera here you got a uh, doggo uh the company is it self-titled um no the company awaking under dogs Woof. uh mind funk uh mind funk this is actually pretty cool i have a mind funk record now i have a mind funk cd as well nice uh and uh payback and it's called ultraviolet that looks looks shady and we'll see uh this also looks kind of shady probably some grindcore or something morpus and it's called uh Lidig, Lidigen, something like that. The title will appear, uh, Leibigen. The title will appear below, but it's more for something. And, uh, oh, this is fun. Remix to Hell, an ACDC tribute. So I wonder if this is going to be, uh, just as, no, at least, so here we got, Actually, we have uh, bands on here. I was thinking that it might be as interesting as, as that that uh, Iron Maiden one he sent me a while ago. But yeah, uh, you got uh, the groups. Uh, you got uh, uh, Motorhead. Uh, you got Anthrax, Twisted Sister, Quiet Riot, um, uh, Great White, uh, Otto Kid Joe. I think it's like just uh, artists from from these bands, so that's going to be good fun. I think I have something by a band with this name as well, Manifest Destiny. Don't know if it's the same band. Um, what you fear? So there you go. And uh, the last one in this envelope was Spirit Crow, and it's called The Signs. Cool. So let's have a look at what's in. The other envelope that uh, was included. So, uh, oh. there's some, uh, I don't know, some stickers in there. Okay, so, uh, so let's see what we have. Wolfsheim Spectators. Is that what cosmic black metal or something? Don't know. The next one is uh, this one here. This one is Great Headhunter, a bizarre gardening accident. I have this one on vinyl and now I also have it on CD. So that's really cool because I quite like that one. Uh, oh, this is also cool because this is a band I've been wanting to check out for a long time. Rumpled Dilt Skin Grinder. And this one is called. Uh, Ghost Maker. Cool. Uh, here we have this one. Arise and Ruin. It's called Night Storms Hail Fire. 
There you go. Looks interesting. Uh, Black Hawk. And this is the end of the world. I do have something by Black Hawk. I can't remember if it's this one. If it is, someone else will, of course, uh, receive it as a part of a VCLT. And uh, I think this is the last one, the major. And it's uh, it's love, love, love. Okay, it's interesting. Yeah. And uh, then you have like a, a flyer there. And uh, the stickers. Cool. Interesting stuff. Uh, some of which, which are new, most of which I did not know. And then we got this mysterious uh, black envelope. Let's see what's in it. It's an, I don't know, a Xerox bot or something. We will see. There you go. Okay. It is open. What might be in it? Christmas. Happy crossed out. Yeah, I do not like Christmas. Uh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. It's just a love poem. Thank you very much, Simon. So there you go. Another insane vclt from mr wet wang himself simon thank you so much for this vclt i have a stack of stuff that simon sent me already so yeah there is gonna be a summer of simon go and check out his channel thanks for watching <laughs>